Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked to evaluate the limit if it exists. We have the limit as x approaches 16 of 4 minus the square root of x over 16x minus x squared. So we can't just plug in 16 directly because we would be then dividing by 0. So what we're going to do is we're going to rationalize the denominator, or sorry, the numerator. We have 4 minus the square root of x, so we're going to multiply it by 4 plus the square root of x. And of course, you have to multiply the denominator by the same thing. And what that's going to do for us is on top, we're going to have 4 times 4, that's 16. And we have 4 times the square root of x minus another 4 times the square root of x, meaning those terms are going to cancel. And we're left with, with subtracting the square root of x squared, the square root of something squared is just the thing itself, so that's x over 16x minus x squared times 4 plus the square root of x. We did this because now, if we take out an x from these terms here, we have x times 16 minus x. Don't forget 4 plus the square root of x. And now we can cancel out 16 minus x from the numerator and the denominator. And we have the limit as x approaches 16 of 1 over x times the square root, um, or sorry, the square root of x plus 4. Right? I rewrote them backwards, but it doesn't really matter. And now we can plug in, and we get 1 over 16 times the square root of 16 plus 4. This is 1 over 16 times 4 plus 4. 1 over 16 times 8, which is 1 over 128. Therefore, the value of this limit is 1 128th. 